let me share some facts with you related to the current state of economic economics in the black community. This generation of blacks will be the first generation not to leave any wealth to the next generation. Let me say that again. This generation of black will be the first generation not to leave any wealth for the next generation. Black people spend over $1.3 billion a year. Get this. It makes them, or us, the eighth richest nation in the world. By 2053, Blacks will have no wealth as a group, not individually, but as a group, and will have a second-class economic status. Get this. Black people are wired to be consumers. We get that feel-good feeling when we go and we purchase something. But how does that happen? Well, let's talk about how it happens. Black people watch 10 hours a day and 72 hours a week of commercial and TV. Get this. As a group, we watch 40% more TV than any other group. My name is Michael Randolph. And I'm with the West Tampa Community Development Corporation. And I want to share our story relevant to how we plan to uh, deal with this issue. So we have an initiative called Investment, Investment 102, From Consumers to Investors. It's focused on teaching people how to make money work for them instead of them working for money. I'll give an example. The person that's buying a pair of tennis shoes, let's say for $400. Instead of spending that $400 on the tennis shoes, you spend that $400 and invest in that company. Or, if you don't have that much money, then you still can invest in that stock by what we call a partial investment. You can invest $5, $6, $7 in terms of your investment. This initiative is going to talk about how do we begin to move from the consumer to the investor. How do we take that $1.3 billion a year and convert it into Black economic power? Again, 40%. We watch TV and commercials 40 more percent than any other group. The next uh, fact is true also. And this is talking about in Hillsborough County. In Hillsborough, when it comes to black businesses, in Hillsborough County, in which Tampa is located, black and brown people make up 50% of the popul population, yet we account for only 5% of the economic cash flow. Let me read that again. We account for only 5% of the economic cash flow. To address that issue, the West Tampa CDC has launched what's known as the Home-Based E-Commerce Initiative, or we call it Building Wealth in the Hood. E-commerce and Home-Based Initiative is the fastest growing 
business in today. We focus on monetizing the person's talent. The e-commerce and home-based business is low cost and no cost. We can we 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 can see a business getting started of anywhere between a thousand to five thousand dollars in investment. The top group that we're looking in looking at is seniors, the youth, low income, fixed income, the disabled, those with criminal records. This is our building wealth initiative, monetizing that talent from the grandma who bakes the best cake you ever use, you ever have taste, and using that talent to monetize it and create it to a home-based business that allows her to make supplemental income. Or the mother who's working two jobs and want to start her own home-based business so she can spend more time at home and make money at the same time. These are different initiatives about home-based. There are literally over 100 different types of home-based businesses from cleaning yards to picking up junk to coming in and um, uh, cleaning up houses. And that list goes on and on and on. Uh, what we do is to monetize that talent and create a business. Again, it goes towards increasing the number of residents that live in Hillsborough County specifically West Tampa, that own their own business. Let me say it again. When it comes to black and brown people in Hillsborough County, we'll account for only 5% of the economic cash flow. We have to change this initiative and turn it on around. Let me say this with these ending notes. This generation of Blacks will be the first generation not to leave any wealth to the next generation. Even though we spend over $1.3 billion a year. At this rate, and let me leave it here, by 2053, Blacks will have no wealth and have a second class economic status. We plan to change that narrative by changing the pie, the, by changing the paradigm, paradigm when it comes to black residents in West Tampa and beyond.